making sure you get paid for every penny you earn. That is the issue the mayor of St. Petersburg plans to tackle today as the city council takes new steps to protect those who aren't being paid the wages they are entitled to. Some are not getting paid at all. ABC Action News reporter Ashley Yor is live outside City Hall. Ashley, how big a problem is this here in Tampa Bay? Dan, it's a pretty big problem. Actually, Pinellas County ranked fourth highest out of the counties in the state of Florida with this problem in Hillsborough County, even worse at second highest on the list. Now here in St. Pete, City Council has voted on an ordinance to battle this what's called wage theft problem. Now it can include people being forced to work off the clock, not getting paid for working overtime or undocumented workers not getting paid at all. The new ordinance would help workers in St. Pete get back some of that money that they're owed. It's modeled after the ordinance in Miami Dade that helped workers get $3.8 million in unpaid wages and cost about $1.8 million in administrative fees. St. Pete would actually hire someone here to handle complaints and set up a separate office for it to the tune of $75 to $100,000 a year. That's kind of what we expect to hear the mayor talking about today right here on the city steps. Uh, that's going to be at 10 o'clock this morning. Of course, we're going to be here and we'll let you know what happens. For now, reporting live, I'm Ashley Yor, ABC Action News.